San Francisco Giants hosting the Arizona Diamondbacks, and the D-backs are plus 165 on the money line. The Giants are minus 200. The over-under is eight runs. The D-backs getting a run and a half at minus 130, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. The Giants laying a run and a half are plus 110, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win this game by two. We've got Bumgarner versus Cobb. Bumgarner pitched once against the Giants this year. Five innings, three runs, three earned. They won that game 8-3. to three. Cobb has pitched twice against the Diamondbacks. Six innings, four runs, three earned. They won 7-5. That was in Arizona. Six innings, three runs, three earned. They've lost 4-3 to three in San Francisco. The D-backs are on a two-game winning streak. They're 7-3 and three in their last 10. They are 21-32 and 32 on the road. They are 66 and 48 on the run line, meaning if you've been betting them that way, they are 18 games over 500, so you've been winning a lot. The D-backs, I mean the Giants, are on a three-game winning streak. They're 6 and 4 in their last 10. They are 32 and 27 at home, and they are 52 and 62 on the run line, meaning if you've been betting them that way, you're 10 games under 500, you've been losing. The Giants are 6 and 12 with Cobb on the mound. They've lost his last four starts, and the over is 10 and 8 in the games in which he pitched him. And for whatever the reason is, the site that I use to collect the data on the pitchers is not showing that Bumgarner is actually the starter. Head-to-head, -head, the Diamondbacks are on a three-game winning streak. However, the home team is on a five-game winning streak. The home team is 8-2. and two. The Diamondbacks are 6-4 and four in their last 10. There have been two one-run games in their last 10 meetings. The underdog getting a run and a half is 7-3. and three. The over has hit in their last two games. The over is 6-4 and four in their last 10 meetings. And the over 8 is 5 Three and two. It's going to sound like I'm hedging here a little bit, but I'm going to take the Giants with the money line solely because they're home. These pitchers' ERAs are damn near identical. I'm going to take the Diamondbacks with the runs, and I'm going to go over and hope that this is like a 6-5 kind of game. These are my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.